بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على رسولنا الكريم أحييكم الله بالأعزاء وأتمنى لكم يوما جميلا مع هذا الدرس الجديد نوميريكال انتجريشن نوميريكال انتجريشن طبعا لدينا هناك لإيجاد التكاملات العددية we are or we have three methods The first one, midpoint roll. The second one, crab zodiacal roll. The last one, septon roll. Midpoint roll. This is the formula. Integral from a to b of x dx equal summation from i equal n to n. From i equal one to n f c i delta x. So the usual rule. This is the formula for this method. Simpson rule. This is the formula for this method. Today we focus on midpoint rule. Midpoint rule. We have this example uh, using the midpoint rule. Write out the midpoint roll approximation of integral from zero to one, three x squared dx with n equal four. How to solve this uh, example by using midpoint roll? <clears throat> First step: find the Delta x equal b minus a over n. B here the end of interval one minus zero over four because n equal four n. It is it is given in the equation. Four. We divided the area to four rectangles. Okay. This is the interval from zero to one. Step two divided this interval for two four sub intervals. Find midpoint for each sub interval. This is the idea here in this uh, step. By using this formula, C i equal. <coughs> Ci minus one plus Ci plus one over two is good. Here, interval from zero to one. Divide this interval four rectangles okay, from zero zero point twenty four or zero point one over four. The second interval. Here we can find what. We can find the midpoint for this interval. One over eight. How do to find it? We can see this this way. C one equal zero plus zero point twenty four five over two equal one over. Put it there in the middle of the interval. Right. Let's see the second interval from 0.25 to 0.5. C2 equals 0.5 plus 0.25 over 2 equal 3 over 8. Put it there in the middle of this interval. is good here. 3 over 8. This is the second midpoint. The next interval we can see from 0 0.5 to 0 0.75 C3, how to find it? 0 0.5 plus 0 0.75 over 2 uh, equal 5 over 8. Put it in the middle of this interval here. Yes, 5 over 8. The last interval. From 0 0.75 to 1, C4 equal 
0 0.75 plus 1 over 2 equals 7 over 8. 7 over 8, put it in the middle of this interval. After find all the midpoints, we can find if x or of ci for all these points in this way that in this step step three find what find values of f of x of, of ci for i equal from one to n right to see if c1 c1 equal 1 over 8 you replace x p1 over 8 because the function there here 3x square remove x put it c1 3 1 over 8 square equal 3 over 64 the same repeat this press step for c2 fc2 equal 3 3 over, this is the C2, 3 over 8, 3 over 8 square times a 3 equal 27 over 64, right? It's good. And repeat this step for f of C3 equal 3, 5, this is C3, 5 over 8 square equal 77 over 64. The last midpoint is C4, not equal 7 over 8 squared times 3 equal 147 over 64. After this, the last step, uh, we can uh, summation all these areas to get the final area. Of the total area find the value of the given integral by using this formula okay integral from 0 to 1 3x square dx equals summation from i equal 1 to n fci delta x this is the formula Substitute in this formula integral from 0 to 1 3 x square dx equal what summation from 1 to 4 because n equal here 4 fci delta x equal 3 over 64 plus plus 27 over uh, 64 plus 75 over 64 plus 147 64 times 1 over 4 equal 252 over 256 the approximately equal 0 0.984375 this is the final answer this is uh, in this lesson we learned how to find the area or the value of the integral by using midpoint rule this is step by step i would finally i would thank you for all efforts that you do for learning and teaching i am really happy to be with you thank you so much see you later in the next lesson assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh